Just when I thought it was going to be a relaxing, slow news day, Cuban Link comes out from left field to let Tony know it's not over and that he did not forget his recent comments. Are you guys not entertained? Are you guys not entertained? Man, roll the clip. 3.9 from the fly skyline. That was to meet the eye. It's your boy, your guy. Rodrigo, Rodrigo, Ramirez. And I'm here with the top news bulletin. Yes, yes. The squad novella is getting deeper and hotter and hotter as the Ramada. When Cuban Link had a bitch up there with a bottle, it's just getting better and better and killer and killer. So listen up, killers, because right now, it wasn't enough that Cuban Link brought back the guy who slapped Tony with a cock nonstop. And it's not enough that he told the story live, word by word, truth by truth. Now he went back to get some footage, some actual footage of the fetus that was born after the cock attack by nonstop and him. Nine months later after the cock attack, it's been rumored, and it's not even a rumor. Here is the proof right here. The son, the cock boy, the little baby cock. Half man, half Caucasian. The kid that couldn't fly. Because he, he couldn't survive. He couldn't get the beak to form because of the bestiality that happened. But anyway, this is just another crazy, crazy, crazy event that happened. And Cuban Link will never hesitate, I think, to me. With the video, Cuban captioned, first man on earth ever to give birth to a baby rooster, or as we say in here in the CLK headquarters all day, the little cock that rocked the cradle. It was caught in film as he birthed the little orally from a throwing up position by the same alleyway that Brenda from Tupac's classic song, Brenda Had a Baby, dumped hers in the trash can. Tony didn't even open up the trash can. He flung his baby up in the air but was too stupid to realize he had no feathers yet. So little baby Tony Cox took flight for five seconds upwards and then spiraled downward is out of control and went beak first onto the cement where he broke his back, his neck, and his young two little balls and passed away on contact. R.I.P. to young Kakatone. First of all, Cuban, you gotta use spell correct or proofread the stuff you write in, man, because this is a bad look. Second of all, now you're saying Kakatone? Kakatone? Sheesh! And you had to bring up Brenda? Now you've taken it too far, Cuban. You're taking it too far. So y'all let me know what y'all think about this, man. Are y'all getting tired of the novella and the bochinche yet? Put your thoughts down in the comments and make sure you like and subscribe and stay connected with Panda Chop News. Peace.